Hello, once again, my name is Harry Wilkinson, and I'd like to talk to you about the double stroke roll, which goes into the buzz roll. This is my book, lesson number one, The Foundation, and it has lots of skills that a person enjoys and needs to play the snare drum, and I show you how those skills adapt into the drum set in the back of the book. I have patterns for jazz and rock and blues showing you how essential drum skills are applied to the drum set and there are several snare drum solos and explanations of counting and stickings and rhythms that you might enjoy so I hope you'll come by Forks Drum Closet and take a look at my book I'd love for you to see it at this time I'm going to go to page 52 in my method book and do the long roll arrangement that I put in there as I was saying about the single stroke roll, they told me to go right, left, right, left, and go faster and faster. And the same thing with a long roll. I've tried to take out the confusion by writing it out in sequence with quarter notes, eighth notes, eighth note triplets, sixteenth notes, and sixteenth note triplets, sixteenth notes that are buzzed, and triplets that are buzzed. It's page 52 in lesson one. It goes like this. Now what I'd like for you to do, if you study this page, is to go through each line one at a time. First line. The second line is written in eighth note triplets. The third line I have written out is double strokes. And I've labeled it fast with 16th notes. And at this point, as we go through the second measure, we increase the tempo a little bit. So when we get to the bounced uh, 16th note triplets, we're moving in a tempo that allows us to bounce comfortably. As I finish that one, I speed up a little bit and I go into the buzzed 16th notes. Now, after I was a grown man and had been drumming quite a while, a friend of mine named Ernie Harris, a great drummer, lives here in Nashville, Tennessee taught me how to roll in triplets because his uncle and his dad were both great drummers and I had never had the opportunity to learn that. So he taught me to roll in this style. And he also explained that if you roll in triplets, as you buzz, as you turn it over, you get rid of that strong hand tendency. So by turning over every third beat, we get more of an even roll. So I'm counting one and a two and a three and a four and a five. Do it a little faster. Now here in Nashville, I think it was back in 1996 around in there, we had the percussion, uh, International Percussion uh, uh, Art Society here, and the, the uh, 
International Convention. And um, we had um, a great drummer explaining things uh, as he demonstrated sonar and DW equipment and Pearl equipment and stuff. His name is Jim Chapin, and he wrote one of the most famous drum books of all times. And Jim was just messing around. <laughs> Just playing for people and having fun on his practice pads and his snare drum and gathering a small crowd. And I said, okay, this is a great chance. I asked him, Jim, would you just please play a buzz roll for me? And he immediately went to this spot on his snare drum. Just off center, I guess if you were looking at a clock calling this 12 at the front on the opposite side of you, it would be like close to two o'clock on your snare head. And I thought, okay, I just learned something important. He went off center to get the excellent buzz. And that was very beneficial, and I wanted to share that with you. Now I'm going to do the long roll the way they taught me, just going starting right, right, left, left, and gradually speeding up. With a slight accent on the second note, one of my favorite drummers of all time was Art Blakey, and I had the distinct honor of getting to meet him and visit with him a couple of times when I was in my youth in New York City. And he always changed soloist as he led his group with a big roll. <laughs> Crash! Like that. So sometime when you listen to Art Blakey, listen for his excellent, powerful roll and pay attention to where he places it. He did a great job of it. So I hope that will help you with understanding the long roll.